Hey, thank you all. I'm proud to be here. So last spring, my home state, Louisiana, created an unconstitutional school voucher program. This program, <laughs> boo, yeah. This program takes millions of dollars from our public schools and uses them to fund unconstitutional, often fly-by-night, private schools. There are schools in Louisiana's program which lack adequate buildings to house their new voucher students. Louisiana taxpayers are spending hundreds of thousands of dollars on a school that is teaching English and math in the gym. Initially, initially Louisiana's program included a school that didn't even meet fire code. Schools are teaching science from what are basically coloring books. Dozens of schools in this program use curricula that do not be, meet basic standards in science or math. I first investigated Louisiana's program when one school was exposed using curriculum that talked that the Loch Ness Monster was real and that its existence disproved the theory of evolution. I quickly discovered that this wasn't just a single school. It was at least 20 schools and likely many more in Louisiana's program that were blatantly using curriculum that would miseducate our students about science and history. I found schools that called scientists sinful men. Other schools used curriculums that apparently taught dragons were real and dinosaurs had one, they were dinosaurs that had once lived with humans. In history class, some schools used a curriculum that reportedly said the KKK was a means of reform and it achieved a certain level of respectability as it worked with politicians. Can you, boo, can you believe that? School voucher programs are wrong. They're wrong for our students and wrong for our schools. We should not create school voucher programs even if they're not funded by taking money from our public schools and they're just funded through creative accounting with tax credits like some in Texas want to do. Private schools who do not receive public money need not be subject to public oversight. But when they accept voucher money, there must be accountability. Last spring, or la last spring, last fall, sorry, the Texas Senate Education Committee held a meeting where they discussed the creation of a school voucher program. Louisiana was cited as a model Texas should follow. <laughs> I testified at that meeting and warned against them following Louisiana's example because it would lead to the funding of teaching of creationism and revisionist history in our classrooms. Senator Dan Patrick, who is now the head of the Senate Education Committee, he cut me off and he asked, now this is only Louisiana, right? <laughs> and so at that time, I didn't have any information about any state besides my home state, Louisiana. But today, I have a message for Senator Patrick and for every legislator in Texas and around the country who support school vouchers. These vouchers are not just a problem in Louisiana. They're a problem that are endemic to school voucher programs all across the country because school voucher programs are fundamentally unaccountable. I investigated school voucher programs in nine states and Washington, D.C. I found over 300 schools teaching creationism and bad history and receiving tens of millions, if not hundreds of millions, of taxpayer dollars. We must stand up, we must speak out, and prevent any new unaccountable creation of school voucher programs from being created. Do we want Texas tax dollars being used to fund private schools teaching creationism? Say no, Texas. Do we want Texas tax dollars being used to teach private schools, teaching, private schools teaching revisionist history and teaching that the KKK was a moral institution? Say no. no. Here in Texas, we must say no to unaccountable school voucher programs. Thank you all for having this rally. I'm so proud to be here. Okay, we need more Zach Cobb.